Hi, I'm Yvonne Marquez with Adelita's Revenge, and this is Marina Carranza with Adelita's Revenge. And today we're reading Lonnie Ray's Marvelous Hair and partnering up with the Long Beach Public Library. Here we go. Lonnie Ray has many talents, but no matter what she is doing or where she travels, there's always one thing that everyone notices about her before they spot anything else. Lonnie Ray has the longest and most marvelous hair anyone has ever seen. Wow, look at that beautiful hair someone calls out. Her hair is so long that it sways behind her like a tail when she walks. And when she runs, it unravels like a silky ribbon behind her. Almost like your hair. Very beautiful hair. <laughs> <laughs> Lonnie Ray always has the most gigantic bun in ballet and the longest braids in jiu-jitsu and the grandest locks in the school. After class, Lonnie Ray and her friend Lila love to practice their dance moves. Together they twirl and swirl and Lonnie Ray's hair spins around them. But some days her hair seems much too lengthy. Her mane can be very burly to tame. Sometimes it spins into places where it doesn't belong. She still loves her hair so. Lonnie Ray and Lila love to pretend they're superheroes. If I were a superhero, Lonnie Ray and Lila love to pretend they're superheroes. Lonnie Ray uh, often proclaims, if I were a superhero, my secret weapon would be my hair. I could stop one crime at a time with a simple flip of my hair. But one day, Lila is not at ballet class. In fact, she's missed several. Concerned, Lonnie Ray calls her friend, but Lila's mother tells her that Lila is unable to come to the phone. Is Lila okay? She loves ballet, and Lonnie Ray stammers. In a somber voice, Lila's mother explains that Lila's sick. Lila has cancer and is getting treatment. She is going through many changes, but we are confident she will make a full recovery. So many thoughts flutter through Lonnie Ray's head as she tries hard to hold back her tears. Lonnie Ray drops the phone and runs to her mother. The only thing she can do is bury her grieving face into the blanket of shiny hair as she clutches onto her mother. Suddenly, with a trembling voice, Lonnie Ray cries, I wish there was something I could do for Lila. Holding her tight, Lonnie Ray's mother answers, it's okay to be sad, but there is something you can do. You can still be a wonderful friend to Lila and be there when she needs you and understand that some days she will need to be alone. Lonnie Ray learns that one change Lila is going through due to her treatments is losing her hair. Lila has lost her confidence and self-esteem. She can barely recognize her own reflection. These changes are hard to cope with on top of being sick. Lonnie Ray has an idea. I will create a beautiful picture to give to Lila. That will cheer her up, thinks Lonnie Ray, but she still feels she has more to do. Next, Lonnie Ray bakes some delicious cupcakes for Lila. Who doesn't love cupcakes? She's a good caring friend. Yeah, who doesn't love cupcakes, <laughs> thinks, thinks Lonnie Ray, but she still feel like she has more to do. Finally, Lonnie Ray has a brilliant idea and she asks her mom for help. The following day, both Lonnie Ray and her mother go to the hair salon. Lonnie Ray asks the stylist to cut off almost all of her hair. She is gonna donate it to a place that makes wigs for those who are sick and trying to get better, just like Lila. Lonnie Ray examines her new do with a gleaming smile across her face and a warmth in her heart. It's marvelous. So 
Such a good little heart. Lila smiles so bright it lights up her eyes when she learns what her friend has done. Lonnie Ray's heart fills like it swirls and twirling, just like when she and Lila used to dance together. It may not solve everything, but it's one action that can make the road to recovery a little smoother. Lonnie Ray still loves her hair, but she discovers that her new superpower is the act of kindness and being a good friend. And this was Lonnie Ray's Marvelous Hair by Yesenia Rodriguez. And we are so happy to have her in our store. Please come visit us at Adelita's Revenge. We're on 4th and Termino in Long Beach. Adios. Thank you. Thank you.